Hello, and welcome to, Today in History, I'm your host, Abdalman El Dara, and I'm excited to take you on a journey through some of the most significant historical events that occurred on this day in history, so let's jump right in. On this day in 168 BCE, a momentous event unfolded as the Romans clashed with the Macedonians under King Perseus at the Battle of Pydna. This historic confrontation resulted in a resounding victory for the Romans, bringing an end to the Macedonian monarchy and paving the way for Rome's annexation of Macedonia. The Battle of Pydna stands as a significant turning point in ancient history, solidifying Roman dominance and reshaping the geopolitical landscape of the Mediterranean. On June 22, 1611, English explorer Henry Hudson, who sought a northern route to Asia, was set adrift in Hudson Bay with his son and seven others by mutineers. The mutiny marked a tragic turn in Hudson's final voyage, leaving their fate uncertain. On June 22, 1633, the Catholic Church forced Galileo Galilei to recant his heliocentric view of the universe during the Inquisition. Galileo's scientific discoveries and support for the Copernican model challenged the prevailing geocentric understanding of the cosmos and sparked controversy within the Church. On June 22, 1774, the Quebec Act received royal assent in Great Britain, effectively expanding the territory of the province of Quebec in North America. The Act granted religious freedoms to Roman Catholics and recognized French civil law, which helped to preserve French-Canadian culture and created tensions between the American colonists and British authorities leading up to the American Revolution. On June 22, 1870, the United States Congress created the Department of Justice, establishing the central agency responsible for enforcing federal law and administering justice. The Department of Justice plays a crucial role in upholding the rule of law and protecting the rights of American citizens. On June 22, 1911, King George V of the United Kingdom was crowned in a ceremony held at Westminster Abbey in London. He succeeded his father, King Edward VII, and reigned as the monarch until his death in 1936. King George V played a pivotal role in maintaining stability during a period of significant social and political change. On June 22, 1941, Germany launched a massive invasion of the Soviet Union, known as Operation Barbarossa, during World War II. The invasion marked a turning point in the war and resulted in years of brutal conflict on the Eastern Front. On June 22, 1944, U.S. President Franklin D. Roosevelt signed the GI Bill into law. The Servicemen's Readjustment Act of 1944 provided support for returning World War II veterans, offering educational opportunities, low-interest home loans, and unemployment benefits, among other provisions. On June 22, 1948, the Soviet Union imposed a blockade on West Berlin, leading to the Berlin Airlift. The airlift, carried out by the United States, the United Kingdom, and other Western allies, provided vital supplies to the blockaded city and showcased the determination to protect the freedom and well-being of its residents. On this day in 1955, the beloved animated musical Lady and the Tramp made its debut in U.S. theaters. Produced by Walt Disney, this enchanting film captured the hearts of audiences with its charming tale of romance between Lady, a refined cocker spaniel, and Tramp, a street smart mutt. Lady and the Tramp remains an enduring classic in Disney's repertoire, celebrated for its memorable characters, delightful songs, and timeless storytelling. On June 22, 1978, James Christie, an astronomer at the United States Naval Observatory, discovered Charon, Pluto's largest moon. The discovery of Charon provided valuable insights into the composition and characteristics of the Pluto system. On this day in 1986, Diego Maradona scored the memorable Hand of God goal, helping Argentina defeat England in a World Cup quarter-final match. Argentina went on to win the tournament. That's it for today's episode of Today in History. 
I hope you enjoyed learning about these significant events that took place on this day throughout history. Join me again tomorrow for another exciting episode. Thanks for watching.